Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Duke Franchise. In the last episode, we caught our second one of the season and absolutely destroyed Florida State. And now let's let's see if we can start going on a little roll here. Let's see if we can actually turn things around and start going on a win streak. And we get another big commit to Duke. Martin Mc... whatever the hell that last name is, CB. We've now gotten two big recruits to come to Duke. A big right guard corner now. And we're getting some more brand exposure, and championship contender is going up as well with that big win that we just got. I like looking at this this recruit. Big right guard, big corner, very sexy. We should also be getting this right guard, or this middle linebacker here, Alex Newsome, very well. That's going to be huge for us. I'm going to like Doug as well over Virginia Tech. I'm hoping that he picks us. Should I schedule a visit for him? Oh my god, there's no way I can schedule a visit against Virginia Tech because so we're going to get crushed. Virginia Tech's actually doing really good. I don't really want to lose him to Virginia Tech, so I might just put 50 hours on him, to be honest. Oh, we lost out on John Yelk, though, that three-star edge rusher. I thought he was really going to want to come to Duke. That's a shame. We got some other right guards that really want to come to Duke as well. Like this guy is going to probably come here. So we're going to have some options for center, especially getting like three good right guards. Like we're going to have some options in the interior offensive line for us for sure. I think I liked the center though. Should I go more after him? He has some decent abilities. Eh. Ooh, this right end that I just found. I might actually start going after him a little bit. We'll offer him a scholarship and uh, send the house to him and just kind of see what happens. i do the same thing with this D-tackle and just kind of just see what happens. Why not? We'll start going after some of these big prospects and kind of just test the waters and just see what happens. And now we're able to go into our game against SMU. Back-to-back -back home games for us, which will be really nice. If we could win this game, SMU is two overall higher than us. But if we could win this game, back-to-back -back wins against teams that are better than us, we could we could start to turn some heads. I wouldn't say anything crazy yet, but I think we could start to turn some heads. Damn, it is bright as hell right now. I don't know why is it so bright in this goddamn stadium. Come on, Boyd. And our very first pass goes to our wide receiver, Boyd, and he's able to pick up three yards for us. Ooh, speed option here. Let's see what happens here. I haven't really run too many option plays. Let's see what happens. Let's just... Jesus Christ, I tried to slide. I tried to slide. I don't like that. I don't like how Murphy's already in the yellow. <laughs> this isn't good. Murphy is starting to... Jesus Christ, Murphy's taking a beating. Uh-oh. This is not good. I don't like how much of a beating our quarterback is already taking. I wonder how Steve Haggins is doing. I feel like he gets hit a lot because I throw it to him a lot. Like, right now. Steve Haggins is able to get a nice little six-yard catch for us. And now we're already in an interesting situation at third and two. Seems like SMU is doing, like, a lot of... Lockdown defense, man defense here. So let's see what happens. Jordan Moore, the GOAT, gets some separation. He makes a big catch. He turns on the Jets, and he gets laid out. Ooh, this first drive, I haven't really liked a lot so far. Because I've seen some big hits on my guys. Jesus Christ. Okay, who is destroying me on the interior line? That defensive end just bitched two of my guys. That's not good. How the defensive... That defensive lineman is winning a 1v2. And now here we are at 3rd and 5. We're not in field goal range yet, so... I could see this potential... Come on, baby! Fucking hell. Can we make this... Fuck no, we can't. Do you see that kicking meter? I think third and five, I have to go for this. Come on, Haggins. I need you, buddy. Come on, Haggins. He's only, he only picked up four yards. 
He only picked up four yards, and Chandler Rivers. Uh-oh, this isn't good. This isn't good. Um, fourth and five, we go for it. We only pick up four yards, one yard short, and now SMU. At least they're only starting on our 30. But there was no way I was going to be able to make that field goal. And if I... Maybe I could have pinned them closer in, but... Oh, well. Ooh. Uh-oh. They're able to get another nice run. Two rushes for 12 yards. Maybe we need to start blitzing a little bit. Seeing if we can try to slow down this running game that they have. They could also be passing on this play, too. Uh, typically, when you move a tight end like that, it always means run play. Rivers is so fucking useless. Hopefully that three-star gem corner that comes to Duke is so much better than Rivers. At least I'll be able to develop that corner, too. I'll be able to develop that three-star corner. Uh... Rivers is just so trash. Thank God he's a senior and he is going to be off my team next year. But it's just... Rivers just sucks, man. Like, he's just not good. Like, there's no other way to put it. He's simply... Oh my God, Haggins! Haggins! That was disgusting, Haggins. Oh my gosh. But yeah, Rivers sucks. Um... Rivers really is bad. And now a little screen pass for us to Jaquez Moore. Probably should have cut that inside, but Jaquez still picks up five yards for us. He's laying on the ground pretty bad, which I don't like. His first catch of the day. My, I'm going to be looking dead. Uh, Jaquez. Oh, Jaquez is wide open. Jaquez doesn't get tackled too badly. And a big tackle there for Jaquez Moore. And now, Jordan Moore is going to be getting the jet sweep here. And he's got blocking, too. J J Jordan Moore! Touchdown! Great weaving there for Jordan Moore. Great weaving. And now the Duke Blue Devils tie this game up 7-7. Seven to seven. And only four plays, we go 75 yards. What a great, great drive there for the Duke Blue Devils. And now, let's see if our defense can do anything here. On special teams, he returned it, so they're only starting on their 18. That first drive was not appealing. They did some damage against our zone, against our man. Uh, Rivers is just trash. Ugh. I don't like that play. Second and three. I can't believe I'm actually blitzing again. This looks like a run play, though, right? Like, this truly looks like a running play. It is! And we're able to stop them. They only pick up two yards, and now it's third and one. If we can do some, like, block shedding here on the defense, this could be a very appealing play if we can stop them. Oh, uh, did we? We did! Our defensive tackle stuffed them, and they're punting! They're not going for it on 4th and inches. If this was me, I probably definitely would be going for this on 4th and inches. But the CPU is punting the ball, and now Duke offense is getting the ball back. Moore is able to get a couple of yards for us. And now it's a tied ball game. Both teams have had two possessions. One where they scored a touchdown, and one where they scored nothing. And now Boyd is able to run up the middle for a nice little 5-yard gain. Good job, Boyd. And now I maybe like Pascal here. I do like Pascal here. What a catch. Dude, if that was he shall who not be named. Harvey, I think, was it? If that was Harvey, man. Uh, we already know that would have been an incomplete pass. And now the goat Haggins was able to turn on the Jets. Do a little tricky uh, little stuff with the sideline there. Pick up a first down for us. Um, you guys are seeing this, right? Like, uh, 
<laughs> what a what? They literally just didn't block him. They literally just didn't block him, and that's two big play touchdowns now for the Duke Blue Devils. Holy crap! Our offense, after failing that first drive, has turned on a light switch and has gone up 14 to seven. And now, now things are looking up for the Duke Blue Devils. I'm liking what I'm seeing from our guys here. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't like that, though. Jalen Knighton. That's a pretty cool name. Uh, I don't like that. I, I can assure you that. That was um not be very appealing. Oh, I read it. Ah. Uh, I went a little too far back. Look at our stadium pulse. Our stadium pulse is so weak. Maybe that's just because we're such a bad team that fans aren't showing up. Which, I don't blame them, honestly. But, if we can turn things around and get a win here and win back-to-back -back games, go 3-5. and five, Imagine if we would have won that Georgia Tech game, too. We would have won three straight. I, I'm, I'm talking like we've won this game. I should not talk like we've won this game. There is still so much football left. We're only up 14 to seven and they have the ball and they get the ball at halftime. There is still so much football left right now. Uh, Dude, this guy's shit. What the hell? Jalen Knight is a pretty good running back. I've never heard of him before for SMU. And he gets the ball again and just a ton of open space. This is the Duke Blue Devils rushing defense that I know that just, for some reason, can't do anything at all. And, pick it. What the fuck, man? Why aren't we jumping the route? Like, against Florida State, we finally started jumping routes. Why is it that we only have gotten one game of route jumping? Is that it? Like, are we just going to only get that one? Is it once per season? And is that Rivers? That is Rivers. Okay. Who else would it be? Why did I even ask that question? Why did I even ask if that was Rivers? You already know that was Rivers. Dude's maybe played like two good games. Has had like two good plays. I shouldn't even say games. He's had two good plays. I shouldn't be returning this. I don't know why I am. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I would have been able to get past those guys. I would have had a lot of open field. And now we're tied 14-14. This has been a heavy offense game. Oh, oh, good, good play, Jaquez. Jaquez with some shifty movement there to pick up a first down. Only two rushes. I felt like Jaquez Morris had more rushes. We'll just do a little check down here to Hazley. He was able to pick up nine yards for us. Very appealing play. And now on second and one, don't really want to risk taking a sack. I don't know why I'm doing this play. I don't know why I'm doing this play. Still don't know why I'm doing this play. Uh, 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 keep running. Keep running more. Uh, that got very scary. I don't know why our running back just stopped there. I thought he was going to keep running. If that would have been picked off, I would have lost my mind. And now, ooh, Jordan Moore with the blocker? Yes, go, Jordan. Just get out of bounds. Don't get anywhere and tear. I fucking hate this, man. How many times am I going to run all the, out of bounds but still get hit? Like, that really better not count towards anywhere and tear. And is Hazley going to be wide open here? No. Jacquez was able to maybe... Was able to do some stuff with that. All right, second and four. Jacquez. Yeah. Their de SMU's defensive line has made a couple of plays now that I haven't been too fond of, I can't lie. But Pascal's just going to get the handoff here. Some confusion. Pick up the nice and easy first down. Now, is this for sure a handoff to Moore? I actually don't know. Okay, it is. Ooh, I probably should have um, juked there. I don't know why I didn't. But the Moors are just 
absolutely lighting up this SMU defense. And Jaquez Moore, with tons of open space, is now able to get a first and goal on the 10-yard line here for the Duke Blue Devils. Moore could be open here for a touch. Okay, I was at least able to throw the ball out. Thank God. Let's do another jet pass, this time to Haggins with his elite speed. Come on, Haggins. Go! Damn. Haggins either got to the one or the two yard line there. Still don't know. Basically the one. And now Jordan Moore. Dive. Touchdown, Duke. Touchdown, Jaquez Moore. Five rushes. 29 yards, one touchdown, and we take a 21 to nothing lead. They even run into our kicker, too. Let's see if our defense can make a stop here. My big concern is that SMU does get the ball at halftime, so if they march down the field, score a touchdown, we get no time. They score another touchdown. Is that Rivers? That is Rivers, man. And this is just embarrassing at this point. Why the fuck's he still out there? I, I'm, I'm actually I'm actually being so serious when I say that. Why is Rivers still out there? Like I don't know what to do at this point. Like I really don't. That's just on me. Jeez, and they're just carving me up right now. They're just carving up our zone, but I can't do man because Rivers is getting absolutely torched by the guy that's covering him. Oh my god. Who's number th thir 33? Like, th is this, like, I don't know if this is a player thing or a, or a Madden thing, but so, what is this? You, you see our safety here, right? See, this is what they're running, okay? Our safety, for some reason, is just uh, uh, running away from the wide, like, he's looking at him, right? Like, do we see our safety looking at this wide open guy right like running right uh, like i don't know if that's a player thing or an ea thing i'm gonna guess that's probably just ea being ass or is that just my player has like the worst awareness known to man so he's just stupid like there, there's possibility it could be a mixture of both but um now it's 21 21 and we only have a minute and 17 seconds to see if we can do anything here. I might like Jaquez more on an out route. Or, uh-oh. Um, not Jaquez more, Jordan more. There being so more, so many mores is just too much for me. All right, we'll just do Jordan more again. He's able to march down the field for us a little bit. All right, I like. We'll, we'll see what happens here. Jesus Christ. I had Higgins wide, or I had Haggins wide open there if I had time to throw. I didn't, though. All right. Ugh, good stuff, Haggins. Dude, Haggins just, like, you're able just to, like, throw the ball. Like, I've done that play a lot because, like, Haggins is just so good. You're just able to turn on the Jets and just make a massive play for us and now that's fucking stupid that's a little stupid there let's go devils uh shit ooh third and two this could be a very interesting play for us i'm gonna be looking for Haley for sure oh my god what a catch and get out of bounds, too. Again, gets tackled. Out of bounds. I'm out of bounds, and I get tackled. So, what the fuck's the point of walking out of bounds in this game, EA? Like, I really want to know what the hell is the point of walking out of bounds when, whenever I go out of bounds, I just get absolutely smoked. I think the goal should be to try to get into field goal range. It looks like they're blitzing, like, a lot. Let, let's just kind of see what happens on this play. I'll check it down to Lampert. We at least got out of bounds. It's third and two. Let's see. We got Haggins. That's probably going to be the guy who I'm looking for. Why did Haggins run so deep? It, 
I don't even fucking want to talk about that shit there. That was stupid as hell. Um, let's see if we can get a maybe hopefully a touchdown here on the screen pass. Let's see how they do against it. Fuck it, Murphy, dude, or the team, the team, stopping ass, everybody. Let's try this again. Oh, shit. I also don't like how I just went so far over to the right as well, because now I'm going to have a really right field goal kick. I think I made this. Okay, I did. It's 24-21. This has been an absolute shootout. Both teams have been stopped one time. For us, it was on our opening drive. For them, it was on their second drive. Uh, but touchdowns and field goals since. We probably would have scored another touchdown there if we would have had time. We're at least up by three, but SMU is going to get the ball to start the second half. So it's like, what would you prefer? The ball first or a three-point lead? With how this game's going, probably prefer the ball because if they score a touchdown, then it's a four-point game, and then I'm forced to score another touchdown. But we're at least up at halftime. And I was just spamming X. Oh my god. And they're going to get great field position starting at the 32-yard line because... I don't know, man. And look at that stadium pulse, man. Oh god. Duke, Duke is here to play. Oh. Damn, dude. Their running game's been really good. Their running game's been good. Their passing game's been good. It's just been it's just been hard for us over here. We need like a we need a touchdown or a defensive stop. Both of those would be great. Oh my god! I Jesus Christ, guys! I should have had a safety over there for sure, but they fooled me. What can I say, man? Like they did a jets sweep and a fake handoff. I thought they were surely running it. I didn't think that was gonna be a pass play. Uh, we just, we can't do anything at all against um, SMU's offense. Like, we just, we really can't. They, they have a wide open guy every single fucking play, man. Like, I, I, like, if I do zone, someone finds the open zone. If I do man, Rivers gets burnt. Oh, smoke the quarterback. Thank you. I would have preferred a hit stick, maybe even a fumble, but they at least wasted a play there. Lost two yards. It's now second and goal from the seven. They're going to run the ball again, and we stop them. Third and goal from the five now. If we can hold them to a field goal here, that would be ginormous. You have no clue how massive this would be if we could hold them to a field goal. And we do. They had to throw it away. Really good defense here. I'm doing safe. I'm not risking any stupid idiot uh, trying to... I I'm just not risking this. Oh my god, they missed it. SMU just missed the field goal. And Jacquez Moore is going to have all the space in the world here for this handoff. And pick up six yards on his opening run. And now as long as we don't mess up this drive, we we have some momentum now. That chip shot missed field goal could really cost SMU. Fuck, man. How did I pick up no yards on that? Are you fucking kidding me? Zero yards on that? What up? Whatever. Come on, Hazley. Wide open and with space, too. Let's see if you can get out of bounds. That's fine. Big play there for us. Fuck it. And the option works to Boyd! Yeah! Dude, that play was sexy right there, actually. That play was sexy. Am I actually going to do a play where I try to throw it deep here? I am. Jordan Moore is going to be wide open? Oh my gosh! Hey! The offense is clicking today, and I am all for it. And now here we are. 
doing a little check down pass to Haggins, and he gets absolutely laid out. I just threw a hospital ball for him. Great job, Cameron. Um, and now here we are, second and goal from the eight, doing a little run with Jaquez Moore. A lot of bodies there, and uh, third and goal from the seven. I think I'm totally fine just doing a little screen pass here to Jaquez. Awesome. I'm so glad that that just worked out for us. We got a field goal out of the drive at least. I was hoping for a touchdown. I definitely botched, what was it, first and goal from like the 8 or the 9. I definitely just botched that. But we at least get a field goal out of it. So regardless if SMU now scores a touchdown, it's only a one-point game. It's only a one-point game. And then a field goal gives us the lead. We don't, we aren't forced to get a touchdown here. And we're doing a very interesting play call here. Oh my God. Also look at Bayer, our free safety. I think he had like has a major injury risk right now. I think I definitely need to sub him out. Like he's probably just getting smoked right now, right? Oh my God. Minus 16 speed. Uh oh. Yeah, let's send the freshman Griffin out there for Bayer. Um, he is facing some serious injury concern. Also, yeah, Rivers just... Is Stenson our slot corner, though, because of that speed? Stenson, I don't really feel like allows too many. Sometimes he does, I guess. Oh, we're apparently doubling that guy? Okay. Oh my god, I thought I should have doubled him. And I honestly thought that um he was about to score a touchdown on us. I'm surprised he even made the tackle there. That could have been really bad. Because if we at least hold him to a field goal attempt like we did last time, they just missed a little chip shot field goal. But as long as they don't score a touchdown, we're gonna take we're gonna keep the lead here. I don't want to really go down. Have we gone down yet this game? We did. We start we went down 7-0. And then made it 14-7. And then since then, it's just been score, 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 score. So we were down 7-0 at one point. But that was in the first quarter when there was no pressure. If we go down 28-27 to in the fourth quarter, there's going to be a lot of pressure on me. And uh, I probably don't handle that too well. Ooh, Factor. I just read that guy like a book. What a play. What a play from the defense there. I am very... Uh, that was a very attractive play, in my opinion. All right. Oh, and they just pick apart our zone. Awesome. I thought we were going to be going to the fourth quarter with the lead. We're actually going to be going into the fourth quarter down. We're going into the fourth quarter down 28 to 27. You know what? It could be worse. But now we have to score. Which, that definitely puts a lot of pressure on us, because now we are being forced to score. Alright, Hazley will just be wide open here for a nice little first down you play. And at the start of the fourth quarter, it is 28-27 SMU. Basically been an equal game. 7-0, 7-0. Only two 7-0 teams. Thankfully, I don't think we have to play any of them. Oh, yeah, Virginia Tech's undefeated, and we do have to play them. This has been a very good game so far, at least. Both teams have been playing some great football, offensively, at least. And, oh, Boyd with the carry there. Who didn't pick up the ball? Who didn't pick up the football? Who just stood on top of it? Who's this moron when the ball's right here? Who's this? What are you doing, number six? What is this? What are you... F why, why are my wide receivers such morons, man? You have got to be kidding me. And now our defense has to get a stop. 
If we don't get a stop, then we're going to have to score a touchdown. And the two points. <sighs> Just heartbreaking stuff here. I would love a turnover of our own. But just... Just such heartbreaking stuff, man. Oh, shit. Devin Red, our best edge rusher, is hurt now. And here we are, third and nine. Defense, I need you to please bail my offense out. Like, just please we don't we don't we don't why would you guys why would you you've made one defensive stop all game i'm i don't count that missed field goal as a real defensive stop and what the fuck are you doing to am i a fucking idiot here like look at number two it should this not be picked off dude you're in front of him what are you doing? What is this coverage? This game is going just fucking downhill. Really fast. At least we still got Haggins. But we need to score fast. Unless our goals... Because we could. We also need to make the two-point conversion as well. Like, the two-point conversion isn't a guarantee. Alright. We at least were able to... Oh, we got the screen pass off at least. I like doing a screen pass again. And just... This game has just completely shifted. Like, I, I really was liking our chances of winning. And just like that, one turnover has just completely shifted this game. Good catch, Boyd. First and goal from the nine. Our last first and goal situation, we were forced to kick a field goal, and <clears throat> that is really coming back to haunt us right now. Just get down, Harvey. All right, second and goal from the four. I might honestly just run this ball three straight times in a row. Great job. We picked up one fucking yard. Come on, Jaquez. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Come on. Thank God. We pick up the first, the touchdown, but it's not over because we still have to get the two-point conversion here, and this could be very scary. Run the ball with Malachi. Malachi? Pick it! Oh my God. And that was number six to redemption. Redemption from number six after he failed to pick up the fumble, which cost, which allowed SMU to score a touchdown and take the lead, <laughs> but was able to get the fumble there. And now it's a tied ball game, and I'm going to tell you exactly how this is going to go. We're going to lose 38 to 35. But you know what? Maybe our defense can surprise me. Like, can our defense get a stop here? We just sent an all out blitz. Oh my god, Reed severe. Reed should not be out there. Okay, he's not. Thank you. Um, and this is now some really scary stuff here. Like, I can't lie. Really scary. Oh my god, okay, he went third and 11. Defense. Please. Defense, please, please, please. Defense. Please. Defense. Please. They're running the ball. Please. Oh, defense! They ran the ball on 3rd and 11! They ran the ball on 3rd and 11! Defense! Why? Why? Why, defense? Why are you selling? Defense! Oh my god. I, I can't even do anything. Our defense is so... just... bad. Oh, just let him fucking score a touchdown at this point. What even was that catch?
Good job, number 26. Dude, look at look at how number 26, or who's supposed to be on the tight end? Oh, number 38. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, great. What the fuck is this? Offensive pass interference? And then what is this catch? What is this catch? Oh, both of his hands are there. But Offensive pass interference. Third and 11, and they ran the fucking ball, and we allow a first down. All right. Well, we need to score a touchdown. I'm scared to go for two as well, because we saw what happened when we tried to go for two last time. With getting absolutely fucking bailed out. And the clock is running, too, which I really don't like. I've just been checking it down to Jaquez more, because that's all I fucking know. And that's the only thing that's working right now, but... Maybe Jordan Moore can be open here. Fuck it. Oh, my God. Why? What the fuck? What happened? What, what is this? What just happened? What just happened? It, 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 wait, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Is that not a, a, a catch? How, how, how the fuck do you get rid of this? Wait a second. Is that, is this not a catch? Wait, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Is, is this not a catch? It, he's got the ball in his hands, right? This is a catch, surely. Please overturn that. Review that. That's a catch. That was a fucking catch. That was a catch, right? Is this not a catch? What do they rule? How? How was that not a catch? Dude, this game is just trying to fucking screw me. Oh my god. Is Jordan Moore going to be wide open here? I don't fucking know, man. Chakwas, please get a first down. We need the time to stop. Come on, Haggins. Come on, Haggins. Oh my god, Hagen scored a touch. Do we go for two? I'm gonna go to overtime. We haven't seen an overtime yet, honestly. I, I kind of want to just test out overtime and see what happens here. Okay. Can I even ice an extra point? I don't think so. We kick the extra point. We tie it. We score a touchdown with five seconds left. Literally, the difference of this game is that the Boyd fumble. Each team gets possession. All right. I guess they're going to do the coin flip, so let's see what happens. It's heads, Duke has won the toss. Yes, I want to go on defense first. I, I agree with them. I like going on defense first because then if they don't score, or then we know what we have to do. Right? We know what we have to do. Oh my god, Rivers actually just forced an incomplete pass there. Unheard of. He probably should have caught it too. He had a jump on Rivers. Um, thankfully, luck's on our side. That is... Two fucking plays. 25-yard touchdown pass. Alright, well... After our elite defense... All right, good catch, Jordan. Second and one. We will just run the ball. I haven't done, like, an outside run play ever yet. Let's see if this works out well for us. And it does. Jaquez Moore. Oh, fuck. I actually hate where we're at. First and goal from the nine. We're now really kind of just screwing ourselves here. Hopefully, Jaquez can pick up some more yards on this play. Jesus fucking Christ. He actually loses yards, probably. Wouldn't doubt. Uh, go to this play. 
more could be open. Like, we got some... Thank God. Now, I don't know what to do here. Like, do I just kick the PAT or do I just go for two now and just get the win? Like, I don't mind just looking at this again. Like, it's either going to be Haggins or Hazley here. I'll just go for one. I'm too scared. Honestly, I'm just too nervous. I'm just hoping... Oh, wait. I'm going to go on offense first, aren't I? Shit, I am. They flip it, and I go on offense first now. Okay. I, my heart's actually racing, because this is such a big fucking game for us. Especially after losing that Georgia Tech game. Like, I don't want to lose another, like, just close game. And... Okay. That was good for me. Hazley, good play there. I know I'm not talking that much, but I promise you, like, my heart is actually just fucking racing right now. Like, it is actually really bad. Like, I can just feel my heart. Like, it's just a video game, but good God, like, this really matters to me. Like, I want to win this game, man. Like, I want to go on a little winning streak. I want this season not to be a complete... I wish she didn't catch that. I wish she didn't catch that. <laughs> wow. That, um... That... <laughs> I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose. We second and five. We caught a shit pass. Wow. Haggins. Maybe. Nope, he's gonna be one yard short. And we're gonna lose the game. Haggins was one yard short. Second and five, we had a screen pass, which we lost five yards on. Then third and ten, we had a wide open guy. And what really sucks about this game, too. The really hard thing about this is at the end of the day, I fucking had a perfect game. I have 49 points. I didn't throw a single interception. Literally, it was just the fumble. Like they're literally just carving apart my zone. On 3rd and 11, we could, we just had to stop a running play and we lose. My defense just allowed fucking 55 points and couldn't do anything. Look at their quarterback had seven passing touchdowns on us. I thought we were going to go on a little hot run there, man. Like, I think we're now officially like out of bowl contention. Like maybe we can win the last four games, but I highly doubt it. Like, uh, dude, our defense just allowed fucking 55 points. Like, this is just so sick. I scored 49 points and lost. Anyways, guys, um, thank you so much for watching. Another just upsetting disappointing loss for duke now this season's just in the shitter nothing i can really say about that guys but thank you so much for watching always leave comments down below on how i can improve the series for you and peace out